SEO and AI. Neuron Writer brings the two together to offer a tool that you can use to write articles and blog posts that should rank in Google search results. But is it worth your time and money? My name is Brian Collins and I've tested Neuron Writer extensively and compared it to competitors. Here's what I found out. If you're unfamiliar with these types of tools, they should help you research, plan, create and publish content for your website or blog. They use natural language processing and AI to create entire articles for you. And they also provide insights about relevant keywords, phrases and terms that you should include in your article so it stands a greater chance of ranking in Google search results. And they can also help you with some competitor analysis. Some of these tools are easy to use and some have a little bit more of a learning curve. I took out a subscription to Neuron Writer to see how it stacked up against some of the other competitors on the market, many of which I've profiled on this channel, so do check those out. Neuron Writer has multiple price plans that you can pick from. The cheapest plan, the bronze plan, costs $23 per month. And you'll be able to analyze 25 articles and get 15,000 AI credits, which is enough to get started generating your first batch of articles. If you're gonna use it as part of your content creation process regularly, you'll probably need to take out the silver or even the gold plan, which go from 45 to $69. There are of course discounts available if you take out an annual subscription. But wait, I don't actually recommend taking out any of these plans if you want to use Neuron Writer. That's because it's still available as an AppSumo deal. So you can get complete access to Neuron Writer for just $89 if you use the AppSumo link. How does the pricing of Neuron Writer compare to competitors? Well, firstly, Koala. This is a tool you can use to generate dozens of articles and I've profiled it in another video on this channel. So check out that video. But to use Koala, you'll need to pay $9, $25 or $49 per month. You can get started with $9, but chances are you're gonna to need to take out a starter or professional subscription at some point. Surfer is another popular tool that creates content with AI and which also optimizes your content for search. And the UI is pretty similar to Neuron Writer as I'll show you in a few moments. It's a little bit more expensive at $69 per month and you'll need to pay extra for AI credits. So not the cheapest tool out there. Jasper is another popular alternative, but it's aimed at small businesses and medium sized businesses. And it's more expensive again. So it will cost you $49 per month to get started. And then if you want to use it consistently with your team, you'll need to pay $125 per month. So basically Neuron Writer is probably one of the cheaper AI tools out there apart from Koala. And you can save even more money by using the AppSumo discount. Once I connected my website to Neuron Writer, I used the tool to come up with some keywords that I wanted to generate content for with the help of AI. I recently took part in an Ironman triathlon. And if you're taking part in a triathlon, you'll need to invest in a good triathlon watch. Now, there are lots of great articles online about the best triathlon watches to buy. Clearly, this is a lucrative keyword that has good search volume. And while I have some content on fitter habits about the Ironman, I don't have any informational content about the best triathlon watches. So could Neuron Writer help me come up with something? So if you have a keyword in mind, like best Ironman watches, you can use Neuron Writer to figure out the search volume and also to see how much content you'll need to create. You simply click on new query and put in the keyword in question, which in this case is best Ironman watch. Then pick your search engine and your preferred language. Now there are some additional settings where you can analyze competitors. I did find this quite helpful. And I actually put in some competitors from some other triathlon websites as well. And if you spend a bit extra time doing this, this will improve the analysis that you're going to get from Neuron Writer. And if you have some secondary keywords, you can also include these too. So I spent a few minutes building out my query with Neuron Writer. And then it told me that the content score is 47, which is a proprietary metric, but would suggest that the content is a little bit competitive. That's no great surprise as these are all pretty big, well-known websites in the triathlon space. And it also said that any content I produce on this topic should be approximately 1,000 words or longer. 
Now, when you click on the keyword in question, it will open up the Neuron Writer Editor. And here's where you can start to leverage AI to create your content. Neuron Writer contains a rich text editor that you can use to write your content or to generate it with AI. So you can also use the menu bar to format your content and add media and images before you press publish. And then on the right hand side, you can see all of the terms and words that you should potentially include in this piece of content. And there are also options for generating outlines and even an entire article, which I'll show you in a few moments. To be honest, all of these AI and content optimization tools use a pretty similar interface. As an example, here is Surfer SEO, which I've also reviewed on this channel. And it's pretty much the same. On the left hand side, you have your rich text editor. You can format your text. On the right hand side, you have a content score similar to what Neuron Writer offers. And then you also have a list of terms, headings, and so on that you should include in your article. And there are also options for generating your outline and for exporting it to your WordPress website. You can, of course, give team members access to Neuron Writer so they can do all of this for you. But whatever your preferred approach, just don't forget to save your work. Because when I was testing Neuron Writer for this review, I lost some of the content that I generated because I'd forgotten to click the save button. That strikes me as a pretty old school way to handle content in an online rich text editor. I tested most of the features inside of Neuron Writer. So first up, you can compare your content to competitors. Simply click on the competitors tab and you can analyze the top 10, 30 or a custom selection. I recommend looking at custom selection so you can get an overview of what's appearing in Google search results. And since the Google helpful content update of September, 2023, Reddit posts are appearing much higher in Google search results. But I might potentially untick Reddit search results as this is a bit different to traditional types of content. And instead, I'd probably just read through the Reddit thread myself. So here's how you use this type of competitor analysis. Basically, look at the outline of an article that's already ranking and use this outline to figure out what you're going to include. Here are two examples. So Tratly.com, which is ranking number one according to Neuron Writer, mentions these particular watches. So I could potentially copy these watch brand names into my article and build out a content brief for a writer or produce the content myself. Now I wouldn't stop at analyzing just one article. So I would scroll down and look at some of the other competitors I've picked. And as an example, 220 Triathlon, which is another big website in the space, talks about the uh, Garmin Epix watch, the Garmin Epix Generation 2, which is actually the watch that I have. And this isn't mentioned in the first article. So by reviewing the outlines of the top five or top 10 pieces of content, you could in theory build out something that's much more in depth and which could rank higher than competitors, assuming you have the right backlinks and domain authority. Now here's where I started to find Neuron Writer a little bit overwhelming. So it also has a section for smart headings and these are potentially subheadings that you can add into your article. And while it was great to be able to add these at a click, I did find that many of these uh, subheadings or smart headings were stuffed with keywords. So I would go and edit these because the content could feel over optimized. I did like the section for questions. So this gave me some information or gave me some inspiration for an FAQ that I could potentially add to the article in question as well. So ideally I could spend 20 or 30 minutes researching the top content or the top pieces of content in the space, reviewing the outlines and then coming up with my own article that I'm going to write myself give to another writer or use AI to generate. In fact, let's use AI to generate this article. Neuron Writer offers lots of different options for using AI to generate content. In fact, it offers so many options that it can be a little bit overwhelming. To show you how some of these work, I've removed all of the headings and subheadings and text that I put into the rich text editor manually. Now I'm just gonna pick article outline to give you an overview of how the AI tool works. And I'm going to type back in my keyword, which is best Ironman watch. Click write for me. And now Neuron Writer will use up some of my credits. So how much credits you have is dependent, of course, on your pricing. And it will provide me with an outline that I could use. Now, this is quite helpful. But to be honest, you can get this from ChatGPT as well. However, if you've paid for Neuron Writer and you're using it, you could use this to write the article yourself or to give to another team member. I'd recommend spending a little bit of time refining your outline till it's firstly accurate and secondly reflective of what you want to include in your article. Then you can use Neuron Writer to write specific sections of your article or even your entire article. Once you have an outline that you're happy with, you can start using 
prompts inside of Neuron Writer to expand on each one of the sections. Now typically it will need at least a few words before it can use AI to generate something for you. But basically highlight the section in question, click on AI writing and use one of these prompts like start paragraph. Then you can determine your preferred output and you can also add some additional information for Neuron Writer. And then when you click on write for me, Neuron Writer will again use up some of your credits to produce a draft for this particular section. Again, you'll need to review this to figure out if it's accurate or irrelevant. The idea of Neuron Writer is that you will use your own research and some of its insights and also templates to create an outline and then an entire article with AI. So as an example, I can select the article intro template. I can put in my keyword that I want to include in the introduction. I can provide some additional prompts, select the preferred tone of voice and so on, and then click write it for me. Now Neuron Writer will produce an introduction that I could potentially use uh, for the article in question. As introductions go, it's not too bad. A little bit generic and I'd probably include some personal impressions, but it's certainly something that I could work with. So basically using uh, the keywords that you've picked and these various AI templates, you could come up with an entire article outline and then even an entire article with AI. If you find it time consuming to create an outline, and then use the various templates to expand on your outline into a fully fledged article. There is an option to generate a one click long form article. Basically put in your keyword and then Neuron Writer will use up some of your credits to generate an entire article for you. At the time of recording the video, there were a couple of caveats. I did notice that this was accessible in the free trial. However, when I took out a premium subscription, the options available under AI writing did change. So do contact support if you can't actually see the option for one click long form article. But I was able to use this to generate an article that I tested. This is a 1300 word article written entirely with AI. So Neuron Writer has given it the headline, the ultimate guide to best triathlon watches. Now arguably that H1 is far too long. So I would shorten that down and put in a number. It's indicated where I can include images or I can use the editor to upload some images myself. And it's also used AI to write each of the specific sections in the article. Now there is some content missing that I would potentially add. For example, the watch that I mentioned earlier in the video, the Garmin Epix is not mentioned in this AI generated article. However, it's more than enough for me to work with. And it's also an article that's pretty accurate in terms of what's available elsewhere online. I don't recommend publishing content that you create with Neuron Writer directly on your site. So as an example, I took that article from Neuron Writer and I put it into originality.ai, which is a tool that you can use to check if something was generated with artificial intelligence. Now, originality is not always accurate, so I would take the results with a pinch of salt. But in this case, it has flagged this article as 100% AI content. So I'd always go back and put in some personal impressions and fact check what you wrote. One feature that I did like from Neuron Writer is its ability to suggest internal links. So basically you need to connect your site to Google Search Console. And once you do, it will analyze all of the similar articles that you have on your website about the topic in question. So I have articles about famous Ironman triathletes, famous female triathletes, best swim run shorts, and so on. And Neuron Writer has suggested that I should link to each one of these articles in the content that I've just produced. So this is a bit of a time saver if you want to hand over internal linking and that part of the content creation process to another team member. You can even leave comments for the team member if they're working directly inside of Neuron Writer. As useful as Neuron Writer is, I did find it quite slow and cumbersome to generate content with AI. So I had to spend quite a bit of time doing some research, then I had to come up with the outline, and then I had to use the various prompts and templates to write sections of the article. And then I had to go and rewrite all of those sections, fact check them and insert personal impressions. Those are all worthwhile things to do, but I could have just written the article from scratch and done some basic research uh, by going through Google search results. In comparison, it only took me a couple of minutes to generate a similar article with Koala Writer. Basically, I put in my keyword, my preferred tone of voice, and changed a number of other settings related to the article in question. And then Koala Writer was able to produce something which was pretty comparable to what Neuron Writer came up with in just a few minutes. Now there is a big caveat, I did paste the same article into originality.ai and it also got flagged as written entirely with artificial intelligence. However, the fact that it was faster for me to generate this article would speed up the process for generating content with AI. 
However, Koala just doesn't provide the same level of insights about how you can optimize your content by including secondary keywords, phrases, and terms like the ones that you will see here on the right-hand sidebar. And it also doesn't integrate with Google Search Console or provide internal linking recommendations. Both tools do provide options for publishing directly to your WordPress website, which can speed up the content publication uh, workflow. I tested the quality of the content generated by Neuron Writer in one other way. ClearScope is a tool that I use to create content briefs and optimize my articles for the web. I profiled ClearScope on another video on this channel, but I consider it a best in class SEO tool, particularly if you're publishing content at scale. So when I took the article that was generated by Neuron Writer, now I didn't make any edits to it, I just basically copied it to my clipboard and pasted it into ClearScope, it got a content grade of C+. And ClearScope suggested that I needed to get an A+, to stand a good chance of ranking. And I'd also need to bump up the word count to 4,000 words. Now based on my experiences using ClearScope, this content grade and suggested word count is relatively accurate. When I took the same unedited AI generated article from Koala, put it into ClearScope, it got a content grade of B minus, and also the word count was a little bit higher. So in summary, if I were to generate an article with Neuron Writer, or perhaps its most comparable competitor, which is Koala, it would probably be faster for me to use Koala. However, I would still need to edit and expand upon the results. Now, obviously all of this does depend on your workflow, your topic, your domain authority, and also your goals for the content in question. But sometimes I do like to geek out about these tools and figure out which is best for my content creation and publication workflow. I liked lots of things about Neuron Writer. So it provides good information about keywords and phrases that you should include in your articles. It's really good at competitor research. And I like that it integrated with Google Search Console and provided internal linking recommendations. It's also relatively affordable compared to higher priced tools like Jasper and Surfer, which I've also profiled on this channel. However, I did find that Neuron Writer is a little bit slow and clunky to use. It really was quite time consuming for me to use the multiple prompts and templates to come up with an outline and then an entire article with AI. And to be honest, at various points during the content creation process, I did feel like I would just be faster doing all of this myself, which kind of defeats the point. It's also fair to say that some comparable competitors are just faster and easier to use too. However, you can't argue with the AppSumo deal that's currently available on Neuron Writer. So if you're interested in testing out a new AI tool, it could be the one for you. What questions do you have about Neuron Writer or any of these AI tools? Are you using them? Let me know in the comments section below the video. And if you wanna get more profiles like this, then don't forget to subscribe to the channel.